Hey, you guys, this is Mr. Sal. Um, looks like this problem was skipped on the last video, which was solving multi-step inequality. So we're going to do this one together. So the first thing I'm going to do here is distribute this one-half into the parentheses to simplify the expression on the right. One-half times seven-fourths. We're just going to put that into the calculator and let it do the work for us. That will give us seven-eighths x right there. And then the one-half uh, times two there on the second part would give us again in the calculator plus one so now my new inequality is 73 48 minus 1 6th x is greater than or equal to 7 8 x plus one now I'm just going to do what we would generally do and that's to keep the x's on the left so that 73 48 I need to zero out and to do that I'm going to have to subtract it from itself so 73 48 minus 73 48 and we'll combine it with its like term there on the right which is the plus 1 so 1 minus 73 48 now that's going to zero that out right there we'll drop the negative 1 6th x which is greater than or equal to the 7 8 x and in my calculator I'm doing 1 minus 73 48 which gives me as a fraction, that would be negative 25 48 right there. Next up, I am going to subtract that 7 8 x from both sides of the inequality to zero that out on the right side of the inequality. So I've got negative 1 6th x minus 7 8 x. And in my calculator, I'm just putting negative 1 6th minus 7 8 because I know it's going to be in x's right there. So in my calculator, that gives me negative 25 20 fourths. <clears throat> now this is still greater than or equal to, but we've zeroed out that 7 eighths x in red, and we're just going to drop this negative 25 40 eighths right there. The final step in this inequality would be to take that negative 25 20 fourths and divide it on both sides of the inequality and what this does is it makes it a 1x which is what we want and over here we'll divide the same divide it by negative 25 20 fourths now since we did divide both sides by this negative here it will flip the inequality in comparison with the x so x now is less than or equal to and I'm just plugging this into my calculator, negative 25 48 divided by negative 25 20 fourths. And in my calculator, that gives me one half right there. So this inequality ends up being that uh, x is less than or equal to one half. And that would be the final answer. Thanks for watching this, you guys. I hope it helped you out. If it did, please subscribe to the channel. Like the video and just make a comment below. We'll see you guys in the next one.